This is how to insert a Goodell airway in an unconscious patient. So our anatomical landmarks are the incisors and the tragus or external auditory meatus. So we start by taking a Goodell airway, which looks like this, that you get them in different sizes. Um, we measure from the incisors to the uh, tragus of the ear, and this one is clearly too small. So again, this is a standard size and measuring approximately, it's still a little bit small, so I'd use a slightly larger one on this patient, which does fit. And so to insert it, you'd open the mouth of the patient, use a tongue depressor to depress the tongue, and you'd insert the Goodell airway, um, rotated 180 degrees upside down. Um, you'd insert it and rotate it um, in a partially inserted position um, and see if it is tolerated by the patient. If it isn't, then you'd need to consider an alternative airway adjunct.